Hey guys, what's up? I am at the end of my rope here. I just lose all the time. Um, alright. I hate the stupid ass. I'm just gonna go B6, whatever. It's not even a move that people play. I'm, maybe I was supposed to go D6, I don't know. <sighs> uh, I don't know why, I just... What is E5 just winning? Okay, Greg, you can't just make every move instantly without thinking for even a second. You're just going to blunder all your pieces away. Like, this is just embarrassing. Because I'm like, I didn't even think. I just play... First of all, I move 4 or 5. This is not the line I play. I play a line, and I just made up a move for no reason. And now I'm just losing a move... St ah, whatever. I'm not going to... Don't worry. I'm not suicidal to the people watching on Twitch right now. I'm going to be all right. I'm just really sad. <laughs> um, okay, I should think. I should think before I make a move. But I'm, I'm probably going to do something ambitious like... I, I don't know. I'm thinking about knight c5, but he's trapping my rook. I don't know. Why, why would knight c5 be any good? It's really hard to... It's hard to say. Um... I don't know. I can't find a good move. Um, now I'm kind of falling like, falling asleep in the middle of the game. Why do I? I'm, I just want to sack my rook, but even though it doesn't look very good, I don't. I don't understand why I'm trying to do that. Or I'm gonna do it, but it, it looks like he just wins my rook. I don't know. Don't know what the hell I'm doing. It's really a mystery to everyone. My brain is messed up right now. Alright, well, queen d3, I guess. And just hope for some, like, weird miracle. Queen d3... I mean, I'm pretty sure you can just go bishop d2. Hold on, my brain hurts. Knight d3, king moves. Um, not sure how that helps me. I'm just going to do this. It doesn't look very good, but... I don't, I don't know what else to do. I don't know what else to do. My world is crumbling around me. Bishop d2, I don't see exactly how I can... I don't see an idea. A queen takes c4, castle, queen side is the problem. And then I just... Uh, let's see, knight d3, king b1. I don't know. I almost win as queen in some lines. Maybe I should go knight d7 right now, because if he goes queen c6, queen c4 becomes much stronger. So I guess I'll do that. And if king a uh, king a7, I'm sorry, queen a7 is probably the best move. But I'm just hoping he puts this queen on the, the c6 square because it opens him up to tricks. Uh, he's still, I'm sure, he's still winning after queen c6, queen c4, king d1. All right, he didn't go for any of my. He didn't allow me to do any of my tricks. Um, or right, I'm gonna just do this. There's no way this is working. Castle queen side. Um, oh, I can at least win the exchange back, like knight d3 and knight f2. Okay, it's better than nothing. Let me just make sure I have nothing better. All right, I'm just gonna do this. Boom! All right, so. I'm down a piece, I guess. I don't even have a pawn for it, which is really disgusting. I would have at least thought I'd have a pawn for it, but I, I just don't. I do have a trick, though. I'm threatening bishop takes knight, queen e4, rook a8. Oh, no, I'm not. The stupid c-pawn. 
That's too bad. Uh, maybe I'm threatening it anyway for some obscure reason with like, involving knight, um, the a3, a2 square. Let me think. Bishop takes, bishop takes queen e4, king a1, rook a8, queen c7. Oh yeah, then the rook on, the rook on, um, is it perpetual? That's interesting. I'm just going to do it. If I can get a draw out of this, my world is beautiful. <laughs> um, King c1 might be the key move. But it you know, obviously opens him up to some stuff. The thing is, I have this perpetual check. Um, I don't know, maybe knight g5 is good. Probably it is. Oh no, queen c6 then. Ooh, glory hallelujah, I'm gonna draw. Let me just make sure I can't win, because queen a4 is possible. I might be winning, actually. Let me think. Uh, tax two things. One of them is checkmate. All right. If I blow this, if I'm blowing something here, I'm gonna be so mad. But looks pretty good. I am a genius. Oh, if I don't win this game, if I don't win this game, I can only, I cannot explain to you. I'm just going to sack this pawn. Oh crap, he can take on f7. Um, I see a forced mate though. No, I don't. It's, uh, it's close to forced mate, but it's just not quite. If queen f7 is so close. I'm going to look harder because it might be forced mate. Oh my god, is this a draw? Take, check, boom. Why am I trying to calculate a forced mate here? He has no threat, right? I can just go knight e4. And, oh my god. Am I going to lose in time? Uh, first I'm going to do this. He has only one check, right? What am I? I'm gonna lose on time now. This is what I, every game. I don't understand how I can be so stupid. Like we already know, I'm gonna lose on time. I could have just taken a draw last move. Instead, I'm doing this, and I know, I know how the game's gonna end. Um, it's really sad, but it's just been happening too much lately to to not realize what's gonna happen. All right, I'm gonna. Oh, maybe I have a perpetual. You know what, I'm going to check him again. I'm going to go rook c8. Screw it. Maybe I'll find something. Probably not, though. The position, I'm still, oh, obviously, I'm still winning. I just have 26 seconds, so I can't, I can't, I can't make anything happen. Um, it's a really embarrassing game. Because, you know, to come back from that position and then still not win, it's just, like, so ridiculous. If I can't win this game, I can never win any game. I'm kind of just scared now that, like, oh, I see a good move. I don't know how good it really is, but it's moderately good. Maybe I'll try and beat this guy on time. Uh, i do this. I'm going to trade queens and go for this end game. Oh shit, knight c3, dude. Ah! Jeez! This is must.
just going to lay here for a little bit. <laughs> it's just like there's something wrong in my brain. Like, it's like I just don't... I'm just... <sighs> queen f5? It's like, it's funny. It's like, like, okay, if he goes knight d4, he can take my queen if I go queen f5. So I hovered my queen over the square with the idea of waiting to see what he does. And then for some reason I made the move anyway. It was like really crazy. It's not like I was that low on time. Everything about this game... I have a hammer. Here's the problem. You know I'm not going to break my computer, because then the video wouldn't get uploaded to YouTube. But I may break something with this hammer. I don't know what. Something. How do you think I got this injury? It's from a blitz game like this. That was going to be my whole saving grace. Because I've recorded a bunch of videos tonight. Lost them all. Actually, I didn't, I didn't lose them all. But I lost a bunch. All of them completely stupid. Then I'm down a rook. And I managed to outplay this guy. Down a rook. And achieve a winning position. I could have achieved a draw. And then before taking the draw, I thought. And I thought. And I found a win. And I was like, oh my god. This is finally going to happen. And then I lose. Lose the game. I, <laughs> um, I, do, I do need the keep. Well, yeah, I guess I could upload the video without the keyboard. Um. <laughs> oh, man. I paid my... I had to pay my taxes tonight, too. So brutal. You know how long it takes to fill out your taxes? I had to invite, like, lots of kids to my chess camp today. I was going to send lots and lots of emails to all the kids. And instead, here I am, sitting in front of my computer, playing blitz, throwing a hammer around. Um, it's already past 2 a.m. I think this is a good game to end things on. What do you guys think? Is there any reason to keep playing after this game? Like, what could be more interesting <laughs> than this chess game? Could I have won is the big question. If I kept my rook on the board somehow... I played rook c6 because I thought it would slow him down. Um, the downside is it precludes me from winning. But, um... These greedy suckers on Twitch, they're like... They're telling me I can't stop it. I need to win a game. But you know it's 2.15. I'm not your, like, performing monkey. I need to sleep. <laughs> They're saying eventually... Well, actually, I gain rating points this game, Matt Slayer. So they're saying eventually I'll get lower-rated players and I'll have to win if I keep losing all my rating points. But I should gain... I mean, it's a travesty. It's a absolute travesty of justice that any player can gain rating points from a game like this. But I actually gain... I gain three rating points. If I keep going at this rate, I'll be I'll be 2,800 soon. Um, I'm gonna put the hammer down for now. Just sit here a little longer. Drink some water, maybe. At some point, my rating just has to get so low that I can't possibly not go on some really good winning streaks, right? Like, it just has to happen if I keep losing all the time. I don't know. Why is all of a sudden... I, find, I noticed that when a bunch of people start to watch this, the, the stream, it, the, the audience, like, grows rapidly. Is that because everyone else searching, like, my, my feed is at the top of the list or something? I don't know. Um, what should I do now? Yeah, I'm contemplating my life, for real. I could, uh, check out my Clash of Clans here. I think I'm ready to do to use my second attack, right? Oh, no, I already did! I already used all my attacks in my Clash of Clan Wars. Um, alright. 
I still got the YouTube video happening too. You got they guys they are all getting to see this as well. Oh, you know what I can do? I have a trash can I can put over my head sometimes when I get really angry. It's empty right now. It's this trash night. They want me to play again. All right, I'm gonna play one more. I'm gonna play one more game of chess and record it. So tomorrow's video for you YouTube fans is gonna be the game after this game, which is gonna be a horrible chess game. I promise. See ya.